Hi everyone, I'm Jo from Jo's Paradise of Colour. Um, in today's video, I will be unpacking all my restock. So if you've been looking forward to me doing this, it's going to be pretty exciting. Um, I did get a lot of new stuff that I don't normally normally get. But over here is my new wheel, the Major Craft Rose, and I ended up getting a Major Craft Rose matching um, Lazy Kate with it and four bobbins. So I think I did really well um, and got. A pretty good bargain. Um, so this one hopefully won't be too long but I do have um, four to five packages. This one is from my one of my suppliers here in Australia, Kathy's Fibers. Um, I purchased some more dyes that I had run out of, and I also got some extra things for myself. <laughs> uh, so something special in here. Oh yeah, that's right. I decided to buy myself one of those um, needle gauges and uh, yarn gauge thing that I've never had before so I can try get a more accurate um, weight on my yarns that's cool Put it down there whoops lost it every sale I make it goes into helping me restock um, so I ended up getting some plum and and I got some bloodwood which is a maroon for um, an order I've got in Texas so there's fuchsia which is a bright pink and my favourite really dark brown which is wombat. So now I can get another order finished which is more Outback. So Colleen you will have your extra dyed fiber done soon. So we'll put that down here. They are in landscape dies. I love how vibrant and how um, exact the colour comes out. I got myself 
some black merino tops for some carding videos and dyeing, not dyeing, carding and spinning videos. So, that's cool, something different other than whites all the time, you know, black, um, These should be more of the chicken silk. Yummy. I got some violet in the chicken silk embroidery threads. I'm using these in my spinning. That one is a beautiful um, rose pink. It's almost plum. It's very, very pretty. Very pretty color. And I got a nice purple. So that's my new stock. My last lots of chicken silks I bought, which I am not sure. I might have taken a picture of it and that's about it. I'm only got a couple left in these. It's like a copper colour, light copper colour, tan. Pearl white. So I keep looking at the TV, not the camera, because you're on my side. So I apologise. Dark red. It's actually a dark tomato red. I'm kind of obsessed with buying these at the moment. Um, that is a beautiful um, deep turquoise colour, not blue. And the last one I've got at the moment is a gold, very pretty. So I'm using these in my plying and selling them in the monthly tutorials. I'm 
this one is from Nundle uh, Woolen Mills. going to get more into the indie dyeing of commercial mill spun yarns instead of just my hand spun. So I've got some really pretty 60% um, merino, 26% um, nylon, 10% uh, alpaca. Might have to just sell that. Only because I'm allergic to alpaca. I did look at the um, ingredients of every one of these that I chose. There was one with alpaca and there one was one without. And I chose the one without, and they still sent me the alpaca. But they don't know I'm allergic to alpaca, so that's not their fault. It is still very beautiful. But um, I won't be able to work with it. So if you want some, let me know. It'll be a hundred grams okay so it's got metallic thread as well um, I don't know it may be okay seeing it's only 10% alpaca but all I can do is test it and if I do get really sick then I'm just going to have to sell it as is without using it, dyeing it or anything like that. Um, so roughly 100 grams, there's 300 grams here, so they'll be sold in the 100 grams with 250 meters each. So that's a shame. Um, we'll see how I go, because normally with alpaca, I will flare up and not be able to breed tomorrow, so, uh, dangerous. Um, I bought some stock yarn I will be selling it at 100 gram tops um, 430 gram uh, sorry there's, there's 430 grams all up here I was thinking with these that I would sell them in mini sets um, and get four mini sets for the socks, sock yarn, or I could go two mini sets and two large skeins. Um, I'm going to dye them up because there's only merino nylon um, and it's machine washable in this one. So Keep an eye out for these to be available soon. I am planning another dying, dying day. This one is eight ply. Um, 
This is roughly 428 grams in this. So that'll make either two sets of mini skeins or uh, and two large ones or four large ones. So it will depend and it will be a surprise how I do it. So keep an eye out for them. Um, but it is very nice yarn, very soft and all from Nundal uh, Woolen Milk. But yes, it's, it's not too bad prices over at Nundal. And then you get free postage after you spend a hundred dollars, so I'm happy. Um, but this one here is beautiful but scary. <laughs> this one, this sparkly one. I'm not going to take it out of the bag just in case. The last package is from my mum. I don't know what that is. So this is Optum fiber. It's it's like a a merino silky color. Uh, a merino silky kind of um what the is going on i don't know don't know some things going on in here in this package I know that there's something inside this bundle of fiber and this is for my friend that has ordered this and the psychedelic peacock gradient. So we've got Celtic design and a fairy on the bottom. Is it a fairy? Yes. Little, two little fairies and it goes all the way up to the top and this is a gift to her for purchasing a large order and having to wait for a few months to get it and this is a thank you for her patience and her understanding for how long it took. So it's something special for her. I will add a little pack of um, fiber for her and um, some instructions on how to use a spindle. So that's a nice little gifty.
Um, so yeah, any orders that are quite big and take um, months to complete or um, if the person's been on a back order for a, a while, I like to um, add a little something in their parcel for them um, when they eventually get it. So the last one I did send off, which they had been waiting for a while also, I gifted them a set of um, stitch markers. So each parcel is different, um, little gift is different, but it has to be an order of the value of 300 plus. So um, those ones are normally around four skeins and up to make. Normally take a long time for me to get them done. Um, so yes, so that's all the pretties, um, that I've ordered and unboxed. So I hope you enjoyed that one. Um, thank you to everyone that has liked my videos, subscribed to my channel, shared my posts, um, liked my Facebook page, followed me on Instagram and, um, and become a valued customer. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um, without you, I wouldn't be able to continue doing what I love and that's creating beautiful things um, from fiber and yeah so thank you bye for now